Grand Prix Insights is presented by Allianz. In my Mercedes GP Petronas Formula One car, the tires are the biggest performance variable. They're constructed as light as strong as possible with a combination of nylon and polyester, and it's woven together because they need to withstand huge forces. The lap time doesn't stay the same from one lap to the next. And this is why in qualifying, the really, really good drivers, which we have with Nico Rosberg and Michael Schumacher, can achieve their performance on the first lap, which is where it counts. Also, um, it's important to note that compared to a road car tire, we run them at a lot less pressure. So we have about 0.8 bar, whereas a road tire, you'll probably typically run even more than two bar. And the reason why is the carcass, the actual construction of the tire itself, is much, much stiffer. It's much, much stiffer because it's taking a lot more vertical load, a lot more downforce than it has to take. So a huge force acting on them, especially the faster I'm going, so especially at the end of a straight. So you need to withstand that. And also huge lateral forces. So in cornering, when I'm, when I'm having about 5G, they need to hold all that too. The tyres come for us from Pirelli in 2011. And there are four compounds available to us. There's a super soft, a soft, a medium, and a hard compound. On top of that, that's just the slick tyre range. We also have an intermediate tyre and an X-wet tyre. Obviously, those two latter tyres we would only run when there was water on track, so it's safe. Over a race weekend, two of those compounds are chosen for us, and we must run them. So one of the regulations in 2011 is during the race, we absolutely have to run both compounds. They're heated before I go out, but still, even though I'm out there, it's going to take me one lap to really get them to work properly, because the heat it needs to be spread out even to the inside of the tire by driving and putting load on it. The optimum tire temperature for them to work best is very, very high. It's between 90 and 110 degrees. So I would absolutely burn my hand if I would put my hand on the tire as I'm coming in, uh, which is quite surprising. Um, and they really, I mean, they have amazing grip, these tires. Because for one, they're a lot softer than road car tires. Um, and they're slick, so there's a lot more tire on the, on the track. It sounds obvious, but all that's holding that car up are the four small black contact patches where the tire is touching the ground. And that's how important it is. Grand Prix Insights was presented by Allianz.